I'm going through a bit of vocal fatigue at the moment, which is not ideal because I have a lot of work on this week. Um, but since it presents in a fairly similar way as a sore throat or a cold, I thought I'd give you a little bit of advice on what I'll be trying to do to rectify it. Uh, firstly, rest as much as you physically can. Um, I don't have that luxury in the next couple of days, so I'm doing what I can today to not speak apart from this video obviously but don't tell anyone and uh, a couple of other things I have a portable steamer uh, which is really nice it uh, just gives a bit of light relief and if you don't have one of those just put some boiling water in a bowl put a flannel or a towel over your head and just breathe shallowly to start with make sure you're not overdoing it uh, but that can uh, release a little bit in your lungs in your throat wherever the infection is and uh, hot water with honey and lemon is always my go-to. My little extra thing is putting a bit of raw ginger cut up into the uh, hot water with honey and lemon. Um, and then when you finish your tea, then you can eat it. It makes it a bit more edible. And uh, it does, in particular, when you've got a tickly throat, that's absolutely the thing to do. The ginger really gives you a bit of relief from that. Uh, if you are a singer and you have to continue singing, teaching, conducting, whatever it is, uh, just think about your support. Healthy singing is even more important when your vocal cords aren't at their best. So don't try and push through. If you need to demonstrate, demonstrate in a range that feels comfortable at the time and always take it day by day. Don't think, oh, I could sing this yesterday, so I should be able to today. It, your voice never, is never the same two days in a row. And particularly when you're feeling tired, uh, run down or ill, then just take it as easy as you possibly can.